A whole industry has developed around the idea that certain scents drive us wild and bring the possibility of sex one step closer. Scientists have long researched for a human pheromone, a secretion that influences sexual behavior. So far, they found only one that comes close. Men produce the hormone androstenone in their apocrine glands, which cluster wherever there's body hair. But it's hardly a love drug. Females hate the smell, generally, of males. The androstenone seems to smell like musk in the beginning and then turns into a urine-like smell. In Vienna, Austria, evolutionary biologist Carl Grammer is leading the world in the hunt for human pheromones. Early in his research, Grammer discovered that there was a point in the female menstrual cycle when women stopped finding the acrid smell of androstenone distasteful and began to like it. Suddenly, at the point of ovulation, males smell good, and attractive males especially smell good. So for men, androstenone is an efficient mating radar, repelling women unless they're fertile. But the link between a woman's sexual interest and a man's smell is even more complex than this. Salty water from a man's sweat glands blends with androstenone from the apocrine glands, and together, they nurture the bacteria that live on the skin. It's a microscopic breeding ground that gives every man a unique smell.